Well, I want to face the Mars, and this article is from the National Broadcasters of Communism. Dr. Six Books, Nix Books, Dr. Seuss Works Halted for Racist Images. Oh my god. These are children's books, you morons. Six Dr. Seuss books, including and the thing that I saw on Mulberry Street and if I ran the zoo, will stop being published because of racist and insensitive imagery the business that preserves and protects the author's legacy said Tuesday. These book you're not preserving and protecting it. You're destroying it is what you're doing, you moron. You lie like a Romulan dog. These books portray People in ways that are hurtful and wrong, Dr. Susan's Enterprises told the Associated Press in a statement that coincided with late author and illustrator's birthday. I guess this guy did do some uh, wartime propaganda, by the way, which always happens. Uh, ceasing sales of these books is only part of our commitment and a broader plan to ensure Dr. Seuss Enterprises catalog represents and supports all communities and families. Unbelievable. Other books affected are McElligot's Pool, I'm Beyond Zebra, Scrambled Egg Super, and The Cat's Quizzer. That's unreal. Decision to cease publication and sales of the books was made last year after months of discussion, the company told AP. Back to Seuss Enterprises, listen and told, took feedback from our audiences, including teachers, academics, and specialists, most of whom uh, came from nut houses in the field as well as part of our review process. Then we worked with a panel of experts, including educators, to review our catalog of titles. Maybe I ought to go buy those books. You know, become collector sayings. Books by Dr. Seuss, who was born Theodore Seuss Geisel in Springfield, Massachusetts, on March 2, 1904, have been translated in dozens of languages, as well as in Braille, and are sold, for more than, sold in more than 100 countries. He died in 1991. He remains popular, earning an estimated $33 million for taxes in 2020, up from just $9.5 million five years ago, the company said. Forbes listed him as number two on its highest paid dead celebrities of 2020, behind only the late pop star Michael Jackson. And this goes on and on. These are kids' books, you idiots. God, you can't do anything anymore while somebody saying you can't do it. Well, you know, they have the right to stop publishing if that's what they want to do. Uh, well, this is just utterly absurd. You can have uh, books and our schools, um, Heather has two mommies, and well, you can't have Dr. Seuss anymore. Even the cat in the hat has received criticism. They want to take creative control away from us. That's what it amounts to. Well, I, uh, put up my, uh, latest video, Celtic Terror. You want to see him politically incorrect? <laughs> anyway, I'm Artifacts of Mars. Trying to keep up on the nutcases in our society. Want to do this type of thing. Thank you, and have a nice day. Thank you for watching.